Hi guys, so we have been working at Askin Bryan College uh, basically to fill out this brand new enclosure uh, for their group of raccoons. Um, these guys have never had kind of a purpose built enclosure before so we really wanted to kind of create something that would allow them to adjust slowly to all these new climbing structures but would be able to increase in challenge as we go. So we've essentially created these seven areas with the triangular platforms coming out from the corridor to the house here there'll be another one of these walkways the keepers are going to add in later um, down to this first platform and then obviously they can then go down to the floor uh, via the rungs on the ladders um, once they get obviously more fit and able they'll just be able to scamper straight up the poles hopefully um, and then we've created these moving walkways uh, between every single one now the idea behind these walkways is actually we can adjust the movement slowly over time so what you're seeing right now is how they would be as the end result with maximum wobble and maximum movement but we can actually adjust that with this chain so when the raccoons first come out we can actually have this de-shackle here attached onto this piece of chain here so the movement is very very limited and then the keepers will then be able to watch how the raccoons get on and step like link by link they can essentially make that movement more and more um, in order to increase their challenge and obviously every now and again they can actually change it completely um, you could even completely change the movement by making the chain links unequal um, and obviously having angles slightly different so there's lots of different ways of actually adjusting this as the raccoons develop and get used to this new enclosure the other angle we wanted to do was actually encouraging these guys all the way out into the enclosure and because they haven't made massive use of their enclosure space that they've had in the past so we've got these feeders you can see uh, at the back here um, we do also have one um, over at the front as well because obviously we don't want to force them out into this area um, but the idea for these ones is basically again getting them climbing getting them working it might seem a little bit pointless given that I can literally just reach this bit here to have this on a pulley system but something that obviously they do here at the college is they do kind of the experiences with younger children um, and obviously lots of places are looking for ways of getting kids involved and feeling like they've done something so actually all we need to do for the kids to get involved is obviously lower that down like that and then even a relatively young child can actually kind of pull that back up clip it back on um, so that way they can do experiences and things where the kids feel like they've fed the animals even though they haven't actually got near the animals um, and just make them feel included and make them feel like they've had a nice experience so we're really pleased with how this has turned out we cannot wait to see how the raccoons get on in here um, and with the reason we've done this enclosure in a kind of a rustic way in the next video you'll see how we've done the goats on the other side which contrasts really really nicely so Look forward to that video as well.